Welcome everybody to another unboxing. Um, today's unboxing is not a shoe unboxing, but it does have to do with shoes. Um, so basically what this is, is a sole premise backpack where you can store, carry, uh, hold up to five uh, pairs of shoes plus luggage. Um, let's just open it and then I'll talk about it you know, as I go, so, um, so actually I found out Soul Premise, I saw, um, Mike Compass review this backpack, um, and I thought it was a good idea for me, because, uh, I travel a lot, have a lot of stuff when I travel, so this was just perfect. Uh, looks like it came with some other things too, so let's open it up and see what Soul Premise sent us. This is just, uh, okay, packing slip, and it came with, I see a hat right there. So, wow, a Soul Premise snapback. It's kind of cool. See that? That came with the backpack for free. Um... So shout out to Soul Premise for that because, you know, that was just something that they wanted to do. Um, and then we have the backpack in here that I'm going to take it out. It's pretty big and it's pretty heavy. So we're going to remove this box. And then this is the backpack right here, sideways. Um, so they say it can hold up to um, five pairs of shoes plus your luggage. So let's go ahead and open this up. Um, and I got this in red tumble leather. They have it in black, brown, and orange. And then this red colorway. Um, all right. So, first thing that I noticed is that it's large. It's really big. I knew that though. I don't have a problem with that. This is TSA approved, which means that it can be used as a carry-on um, and stored up top. Um, you could probably get away with it if you didn't pack it too much with being going under your seat, but it is a little bit large for that, so keep that in mind. Um, but yeah, so let's, oh, let's get into it. And then I will probably pack it for you guys a little bit and show you guys what it can do. So right away I see this is open. That's what kind of makes it smaller for the shipping. But you got a compartment down here where you can put a pair of shoes. Um, now see, this is convenient. I know most of my followers or subscribers um, probably aren't into sneakers as much. I stopped doing sneaker reviews. Um, but... They watch, you guys probably watch for my um, soccer boots. And this is a perfect bag for that. Let me tell you why. So if you can hold five pairs of shoes, imagine this would be the perfect um, companion, so to speak, when you go on tournaments for like a weekend tournament or something. I know a lot of people probably do that. So you would be able to fit probably two or three pairs of cleats. If you're like me, I like to take two or three pairs with me just in, to a game one game uh let alone a whole tournament i'm i would take my soft ground i would take in two different other pairs you know a mercurio a temple just just to get something different this is a perfect bag for that not only would i be able to take my soccer equipment but i'd be able to pack my stuff in this as well so i wouldn't have to be taking two or three bags with me so this is really convenient for that and like i said it stores everything. A laptop, you could take a laptop, you could you could put a um, uh, pair of shoes. Like for me, that I like to have my sneakers and my soccer cleats, this is just perfect. Like I said, if I want to go to a tournament or I got something planned where I'm going to play a game, maybe I want to shower after or something and then go out, this is perfect because I'd be able to carry my uniform, I'd be able to carry my two or three pairs of cleats, I'd be able to carry my clothes after, plus my sneakers and still probably one or two pairs of sneakers um so like i said there's that zipper 
everything is pretty heavy duty. Um, let's get this zipped up around. And like I said, this is quality leather as well. Um, I, at first I was going to go with the brown um, leather, but I changed my mind because I just like red and it's something different. And I just, it just, I just think it would pop more, I guess. Um, so then, okay, so here we got one zipper. So you could be able to put uh, cables, wires, things like that. And there's another one here. Um, just hold more stuff. Um, and then, so you got a compartment here that'll open up. And these, the pockets, the zippers are really big. Look at that. So it opens up. You'd be able to put a pair of shoes right here, another pair right here, and then you just store some other things in here on this side. Um, like I said, it has tons of room, lots and lots of room for you. Let me show you. You could probably get away with putting, you know, some more stuff right there. A lot of clothes actually. And it's got some components here, something right there that you might want, and something right here. And so then you can close that up. Now, like I said, I'm gonna pack this up and, and show you guys all what it'll look like, you know, on and packed with stuff. Um, I'm gonna try, see, I wear a 10 and a half. They say it holds up to, I think, a 14 or 15. I'm not sure exactly. Um, so then in here, in this pocket, which doesn't open up as wide, is where you put your laptop, holds probably a 15 to 16 inch laptop right here. My backpack's gotta have a laptop sleeve because I like to travel. So the, the, the thing about this backpack that I like is that not only will it hold my shoes and my clothes, but I could take everything. I carry around with three to four cameras sometimes, batteries, my laptop, you know, just travel. I just came back from a trip, like I said, and my backpack was heavy and it was stuffed to the max. And then my carry-on was, you know, stuffed to the max. Now, if I could do that all in one backpack, that's just way much better, you know? Um, and then, like I said, in here, then there's another pocket for you to use. Put in, you know, whatever you want. But it's pretty deep. Look how, how deep. Look at my arm, how far it goes in there. So... You'll be able to put a lot of stuff in here, um, that's for sure. And then, so we'll open up the last compartment. Close that up. Up the last compartment here. And there you go. And then you got the same exact setup as the other one. So it's the same thing. Put a pair of shoes here, pair of shoes there, pair of shoes there, pair of shoes there. Um, so that's pretty much the backpack with the pockets, the zippers. Um, like I said, it's all heavy duty, all good quality leather. Um, and then the straps. To me, the straps are important. You gotta have thick straps. My backpack's gotta have for th um, thick straps. It has this to help take the weight off your back as well because then it's you, you know using your chest. It's not all just from your shoulders and your back. So I love my backpacks to have this. Um, it's such a nice, convenient thing to add, which a lot of places don't, you know, I got a coach backpack, um, and it doesn't have that. And, you know, I really miss having that. So now, like I said, this will be probably my main backpack to carry around, um, a lot of stuff. So, um, and then this is very padded as well back here. Um, so that's good to have that on your back. You know, your stuff isn't just right, pushed right up against you. It's got some padding right there. Um, so, yeah, that's the backpack with all the pockets and everything. Um, I'm going to try to fill it and then show you guys what it would look like. Now, I'm probably just going to try. I'm going to try to grab my bulkiest shoes that I can to see if they're going to fit. You know, um, just 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 to see because I, I only wear a 10 and a half. Um, I, I know a lot of people have said sometimes maybe the, the bigger shoes don't fit, but I'm going to check my 10 and a half with the bulky shoes, like some LeBrons or something like that, just to throw in here, just to see if they're going to fit. So let me get some B-roll and then I'll show you guys what that looks like.
Okay, everybody, so this is the backpack on me. Sorry if you can't see my face, but this I have five shoes in here right now. Um, this is what it would look like. It is a little bit big. It is a little bit maybe exaggerated, but like I said, you're cutting down in having to take um, two or three pieces of luggage and doing it one. Now I'll show you guys what I put in here. Um, I was able to put five pairs of shoes. I put in some Kyrie's, you know, because those would be my playing shoes. Uh, I put in some LeBron uh, 15s. I put in some Jordan 1s, and then I just put in some um, Jordan 10s, and then I threw in a, 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 the Pippin Maestri in there. Um, and yeah, it fit. Um, I 10 and a half, they fit good. All the shoes fit good. I don't know if um, bigger sizes will work or not, but I mean, if it says so, like I didn't struggle to get my shoes in by any means. Everything was um, easy to put in. So um, it, it, it's good and it doesn't feel like that much weight. So I would have no problem. Maybe you don't need to take five pairs of shoes. If you're going on a, a weekend or say you're going to like sneaker con or something, um, maybe you just want to take two or three pairs and that gives you more room. I could probably fit more stuff on this in this um, bottom compartment right here. Um, but like I said, this is all just shoes, no clothes, no computer, no uh, cameras, anything like that. But like I said, it feels good, feels great, a little big, um, but that's that's not a problem. So let me open it up and show you guys. Hopefully, I can. Hey, let me pull this chair right here. Just to set it right here. Um, okay, guys. So this is what the bag looks like. I didn't put nothing in the middle compartment yet, like because, like I said, it, I would just put my laptop in there. Um, so I mean, it's not going to add much bulk because my laptop is pretty thin. Um, just the cables, like I said, my camera, whatever. This is this is not me normal. I don't really take. Uh, five pairs of shoes with me most people some somebody might but i wouldn't uh, like i said i put in this pair of shoes in it because it's bulky i just wanted to um show you guys what it would look like if you carried some bulky shoes um, and those fit in easy i didn't struggle at all and the good thing is they're protected while they're in here um they have padding so your shoes aren't going to get crushed. These are okay. Like I said, some 10s just because. A little bit bulky. Um, and they fit in there fine. And if you notice, the compartment has like this um, outer. So it protects it. They're not smashed on top of each other. So that's what I like about the bag. Um, so then going to the other side then. You open it up. This is where I put the Jordan 1s, as you can see. And it opens, this compartment goes all the way around. So like I said, you will have no trouble putting your shoes in and it opens up. Um, so I recommend putting the shoe that you're going to put the deepest in first and then the one closest to the outside in last. And like I said, these are big. They're bulky, and they fit in there like nothing. And then up here is where I put my uh, Kyrie twos that I like to hoop in when I do hoop. I don't hoop that much anymore, but there you go. Another kind of a bulky shoe, not that much, but bulky enough or you know heavy enough where you could see. Um, and then, like I said, on the bottom is where I put the Lebrons. So let's see if I can open that up. <laughs> Opens up and, and and you could store probably more than just one thing in here. More than one pair of shoes. Uh, you could put in some clothes with it. Maybe if you have like some Yeezys or, or anything like that, then look at, see how deep it is, everything? And there's plenty of room all around there that you can see. There's still a lot of room. So... You have endless possibilities of um, storing stuff and uh, 
and uh, just just carrying all your things no problem good quality leather like i said i didn't feel nothing else so i could still fill pockets i could still fill the the middle pocket i could put stuff in here my clothes um this is perfect for you know that weekend to five to six day trip i would say um and it's perfect um so let's close it all up and then i'll give you my final thoughts on the backpack all right so my final thoughts on the backpack is i think it's great um i didn't talk about price so pricing um it's about i want to say 250 around there um i happen to get it for 151 i think it was because they had like a end of the summer sale and then i was able to use another coupon for 30 percent off something like that i don't remember exactly so yeah that's i got it for a really good price i would say because it's leather it feels durable like i said it's a little big but that's okay for me i knew that it was going to be big um, I need it because I carry a lot of stuff. Like I said, I'm not going to use it for five pairs of sneakers. I'm just using it for when I travel, um, uh, so, some clothes, my laptop, my cameras, my cameras especially. Now, this is convenient because this will fit up top, TSA approved. Um, so it'll trap, my stuff will travel with me. I don't have to, you know, pack it up or, or, or send it separately and then it gets lost or anything like that. Like my valuable stuff is going to be with me. My sneakers are valuable too. So therefore, you know, if you try, if you really like your, your sneakers, you don't want to uh, pass them through. You know, you want to take them with you. This is the perfect bag to do it. Um, they do make a smaller bag. I believe it's called the Commuter. I'm not too, don't quote me on that. Uh, but you can go to soulpremise.com, check it out. They also, I'm going to try to order is like a duffel bag that, um, you know, uh, it holds like two pairs of shoes and then your bag. So I may be interested in ordering that and then doing a review on that um, but this is just perfect you can use this for the gym whether you go hoop whether you go on the weekend look how look how nice it just looks like this red just pops out you know what i'm saying so um definitely a keeper a bag and then if you can get it at a discount uh it's even better so that's my review go to soulpremise.com if you like this if you like the video give it a like um, smash the like button, subscribe, uh, comments, do it all. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.